Hi guys. Um, my mom bought me this book for Easter, so I'm gonna test out one of my experiments. I chose this one because this is the thing I really had the stuff to do, and so this is the one I'm doing. It's a rubber band paddle boat, and I am going to make it. As you can see right here, I have all the stuff already. I already broke the sp the spoons. So I just, it was normally like this, I just broke them both, um, taped them together. As you can see, um, one is right ways up, uh, right side up, and the other one's upside down, because it goes like that. Um, so I have a rubber band, two pencils, and I'm using scotch tape instead of duct tape, because I, I don't know where the duct tape is. But it's two wooden skewers. If you don't have those, or, uh, Th throw away well, chopsticks you could, or popsicle sticks you could use pencils you also need a water bottle and and so I'm gonna get building first we're gonna tape the pencils to the water bottle I get some tape get the wa uh, the pencil Put the tape on and so um, while I do this, you can look at the picture of what it will look like at the end. And so I finished taping. I I did a little to hold down the pencils and I did a few wraps around just since I'm not using duct tape and scotch tape isn't that strong. So I get the rubber band, put it across like this, put the spoons in. As I said earlier, um, one was right side up and the other is upside down. You could also say it's concave and convex. Okay, so I'm just going to start spinning. This will take a while. You have to spin it around a lot so that it has enough power. So as you can see, we got it spun around pretty good. I spun it for like a minute or two. Okay, I'm going to test it out. I'm going to sit in the water. But at your house you could use like, if you don't have a pool, you could use like a bathtub or a little water bucket. Okay. Oh. I spun it backwards. <laughs> the water is too resistant. So I realized I messed up. I spun the thing the wrong way, and I saw it was kind—it of, was kind of resistant and didn't really want to spin. And so I had to um, redo it. I—I I spun it the other way. I might need—I might need to get a new rubber band because this one is easy to stretch. I want one that's not that hard. It's—it's it's still a little tricky to stretch, but it's new so it won't snap so it will push harder because this rubber band I don't think it's hard enough so I had to spin it even more than last time to push it further and you don't want to spin it like this okay you don't want the the like the upwards part to go inwards you want it to go down okay and if you want you could do like marks or something to know Okay, I'm gonna test it out. Yeah, I need a I need a better rubber band. At least it's pushing. I need a better rubber band. But it's going, it's going in circles. So I since it's pulling too much, instead of getting a new band a rubber band. I put part of the broken spoon here and just taped it on so it pulls it apart and then I now I can wind it up more so I'm just gonna wind it up set it down let's get going oh it spins that's fun that's a cool yeah result yeah, it's, it's not what I thought it would be. I thought I'd push it forwards, but...
We're just gonna try it one more time for fun. Okay, so I'm gonna go. Oh. Look, if you do this, it still works. It doesn't matter which way it goes. It's actually kinda cool like that. Works better. Make sure to subscribe to my channel because I got a whole book to do.